All right, I'm about to do a frame swap on this thing. Fifth scale Rovan, whatever you want to call it. Uh, what else is it called? I forget. Frame broke up here. I got a uh, new frame, new support plate. So those are both going on. Take the frame out of the package, get that going. Make sure it's not the new one will not damage first. Which it don't look too too bad. There is a little bit of Nick rash on the front from the shipping. But I'm still gonna put it on. This piece is a reinforcement. It'll go on the bottom of the frame. I've seen people do this before they have a problem with the frame breaking. So once you get that on there, it goes on there, reinforces it. I was thinking about maybe getting one and trimming it down from the inside too and double stacking them, but too late for that. I have to do that later if I'm going to even do it. Put the garbage over there and start picking this apart. Just five pins on this thing. I don't know how many. I haven't had this apart yet. There's five there. Oh, these fake lights have pins on them too, so those will come out. You see that, Mike? These things are fake. That's how I try to get over on people. What? They can be set up to have actual lights put in them. It just takes yeah, a little time. It would be cool. I wouldn't mind doing that sometime. Get the real lights on there. That a lot easier. Oh, that's two pieces. Nice. Two pieces. Okay. <clears throat> that's cool. That's on. Wow, that's neat. All this oh, yeah. stuff. Got long all fuel lines too. Yeah. It looks like I should be able to just unclip all this stuff Excellent. and see how. I wasn't trying to race and do it, but we'll see how fast it can be done, maybe, huh? Mm-hmm. Sometimes it just takes a little memory, you know? Sometimes. Goes together the same way you pull it apart. I guess I didn't even need that. Come on, maybe that was missing. I don't know. Yeah. Another cotter pin in front of you. I'm going to leave. It might need to come off to change that all up. But you're, you're right. I'm going to take the bottom so the whole thing. I'm going to see if I'll take the whole bottom off. That four millimeter is loose. Five thirty second fit better. Anything that's bolted to the frame, I'm going to just unscrew it. Nifty little Allen head to it there. Oh, yeah, 
it's gonna pop apart in a moment. Oh yeah, I see what you're saying. It's kind of flexing already. Oh yeah. yeah. That means you're doing it. Oh, we're good. Ah, <laughs> oh, something's happening, right? Oh yeah. Just need see if that'll okay. The roll bar piece and the pin here. Pin pin. Ah, yeah, that whole front end's loose now. Swing that out of the way. You don't even need both these. You just need the front pins out of there. You swing these out. Pull this foliage out of here. So let me see that little back in here. We're good. Tracking all the electronics and the gas tank. Well, I think the electronics are. Oh, yeah, you might be right. The electronics looks like they screw in from the top. <clears throat> all right, we'll be all right. Get a buff out. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I don't like how tight that was. Mm. You're lucky there. Sometimes you turn them and they want to strip, so. It's a bad thing. I don't like that. I might have to drill that one out. I don't like that. It does get to that point. Some people let their cars go too long and never do any TLC with them. I'm not That's calling not you that. that. Well, my cars are messed up, but I might go get that torch and heat that up a little bit. <clears throat> Done it. If you know where it is, I can go grab it. I don't know. That's I'm going to have to go look for it for a second. And the fuel tank's right there, so I don't want to go too too because I want to get a fire extinguisher right? first. Uh, get a fire extinguisher first, buddy. Remember, when you get in going up the flames, it'll make it work quick. It's hot, it's hot. <laughs> Man, I hope I can get that other screw out. Looks like they might have done they get a Loctite. No, they ain't do Loctite on it. That screws into the other back half, I think. 
Let's see mm. what the hell takes this down. That uh, clip on the other side? Or maybe. I think there is a clip on the other side. We'll figure it out. What's up? These two pieces. There's a clip to this. Oh, okay. Oh, there we go. Uh, oh, it slides. See how it says oh, the notches? No, there it you go. See, you see, how it see how that goes. Oh, man. So I got to make sure. Because that plate's thicker. Oh, yeah. And that bolts to that. So it's a two part frame. Mm -hmm. Now we're. Hey, figuring out how this whole thing goes together. There might be three. Figuring pieces. stuff out. And it's all metal or aluminum, so. Yeah, I don't know. Can you hold that for one second right there, Mike? Hold that still right there. I'm going to do what I can here. Oh, that was me. That was my fault. Mm. Let me see. Let's see this. I right. got the car? Yep. yep. I'll hold it in place for a moment. Make sure it's still on it. Yeah, we're still rocking and rolling. Yeah, that's all right. Mm -hmm. There we go. I can tell us like that. Look at that beauty right there. Now, I want to undo the front. So that way, that hole. Uh, well, well, well. I think what I'm going to do is take this thing no. off. Yeah, you know, steering servo is connected to the front. Is that way the whole front will come off, you know what I mean? It, it might, just for that, yeah. Yeah. And that way that whole thing can just be separate. It's, it's true. It might be a wire or something, isn't it? Uh, uh, oh, that's why. I see. I see. Hold on. <laughs> You the man. There it is. Look at that. That's where it huh. broke. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. Make sure this ain't going to come out. Oh, that right. won't. Okay, that's on there. Mm. That that's a big steering sir. That's like two or three times yeah, the size boy. of my car. I'm just hoping the wiring from that will go to the new receiver because I'm going to get the Dumbo. Mm. I looked at it. It's like $35. Oh, yeah. the receiver, as long as it's got the three-prong input, you don't have to change That's what I'm going to look. Once once we get this all apart, mm -hmm. I'm going to see if it has the oh, yeah. three-prong. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. They should. I think a lot of them come with that now. Two or three. And it's got like a little thing on it. Some people know I'm it, surprised that it's been this easy so far. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Not even 15 minutes. I might do a part one and part two. Removal and then put, it back put together. Yeah, because I because mm -hmm. I'm going to leave it apart to do the the Dumbo stuff. Yeah, yeah. Dumbo RC. If you're watching this video, Dumbo RC is a transmitter and receivers you can get for a little less than 30 bucks and they work great. They come it, up to four, five, six channels. The there stock you know. one on this car out of nowhere started like having weird problems like jittery issues, just randomly giving itself throttle and shaking yeah. and stuff. There's so uh, bad link up somewhere, wires touching, or it's just not very good. Nah, I just don't think it's very yeah. good, dude. <clears throat> a lot of these RC cars come with a weaker steering server than they need. This like, went into this one into the frame. There's a new frame. Let me see that new frame. I don't think that new frame has it. I don't think the new frame has the thing where it bolts into. See what I'm saying? The old, the old frame. I hear one comes up right now. Mm -hmm. You know, that Bruh. upper lip. Bruh, it's kind of. I don't know. Maybe. You know what I think I'm going to do? 
Is that two pieces? Or is it broken? Oh, it that? broke That's underneath it. Yeah, Look. okay, so that there's two pieces there. So there. it's two pieces, all right. Never, like a, what I'm taking off is not the actual frame. What I'm taking off is the end yeah. That's the a protector. Good That's a good thing. I don't know where my other screw went for this, though. There we go. Alright, now this should slide forward. That's the rest of the frame, that right there. That is that piece. That's where it broke. Yep, the other way. That's what it is, right there. Yep, that's the so There we go. That's that. That's the other. That's good. Reuse that. All right. All right. All right. Darn. Oh, well. Still in contact. I think this might have got bent a little bit, too. See that? I think these might be. Mm. Might need to be bent down. Oh, well, no. I need could, to. could, but I try to see what it looks like when you put it back together. Yep. Before I wouldn't bend them until it's like kind of needed. I got new A arms and everything too. I know, same case. It's beautiful. In case I, need I wouldn't to switch them anything. until they're broke. Poo -hoo. Nah, I ain't gonna do that. I'm just making sure this is supposed to be. I guess it's supposed to have a little play. Just oh. allow everything to be bolted up and stuff. Yeah, usually everything does. A lot of people don't like to play in between the front wheels when you. You're going straight, we pick it up and they, they would go a little bit. Alright, I'm gonna pause this. Alright, now we're back. I'm trying to uh, address this stuck screw right here. I'm gonna flip this over the other way. And I can't quite see. I'm trying to see it right down in there. I'm gonna hit it with a little bit of. PB, liquid wrench, whatever. And the fuel tank's right there. Yeah, so I'm going to pause this while I go get a fire extinguisher. Yeah. All right, back with the fire extinguisher. I'm going to pull the safety pin out of here so it should be live. Hopefully it's a good fire extinguisher. Here, Mikey, yeah. I want you to be ready on the fire extinguisher. Press it down and go, I if, got you. If a fire happened, not, not a... No, hang on, <laughs> I ain't gonna be funny now. Man, that's no, a waste. No playing around. This stuff ain't good to smell. All right, Matt gas. Here good. I'm burp, burp, burp. On. Make sure I got my... Hopefully we got lucky. Make sure I got the right... Make sure... Which one is better? Oh, now the four there fits those go. better. Oh, right. yeah. I'm still trying to put a little heat to it. As long as that the spray dried out. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Mm -hmm. uh, eight. Come on. not stripping the screw it's kind of wiggling that out of that let me go get a three mil or a four mil let me get a four millimeter for the impact pause this all right back to this grab the can you grab the extinguisher yeah yeah extinguisher i think this is a dun, dun, dun. oh yeah yeah the tighter the fit of the allen head, the better you're going to do. Oh. Listen, sometimes you got to tighten a bolt more than... Uh, I set that I down did. on the damn yeah. thing. And, <laughs> yeah. I said sometimes you got to tighten it a little bit before you loosen it. Because that's how the screws and bolts get. That's how you heat them up. It could be anything, but... I think this is just because they use a steel bolt and aluminum, and it's probably corroded. <laughs> more than likely. I'm going to heat it up a little more. They always make them the way you got to spend money somehow. Unless you know what you're doing.
stripped her out, man. Mm. It ain't happening. Mm. Now, I'm going to drill it out. And that's the route we're going to I can't take. remember what that piece is called, but people will know. Really Alright, now hopefully this works. It's not too Ready. hot. quite big enough. It's all right. gotta go get a drill that'll fit the impact ah uh, pause it again now we had to do all oh. this to get this yeah i was wrong. Out. it was ordered on october 14th i got it recorded again now I got all this to get this bolt out see if this will work Just go slower on this one. Yeah. Sometimes you gotta work with what you got. There we go. That's a big drill bit too. See if I can get the bolt out of that thing. I thought that battery on the charger would tell me what to plug it in if you need it. Yeah, I don't have the charger for it. Oh, I got another screw I gotta get out on the other side, on this side. You got it, big man. You me. That's that'll be it. That's the last <clears throat> bolt to get out. Yeah, it's, it's still like it's still like in fourteen bolts. Two, four, six, eight, nine, eleven, twelve, twenty. And I did find these new ones. It comes uh probably for that. Yeah, those are longer bolts for the front piece. We got a new Now, 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 I gotta figure that out. How to get all this stuff unhooked. Yeah, that's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. 
Patience and knowledge. Awesome. Get all this stuff over to the side. I'll vacuum the table off. Oh, what's the guy right here? There's a place oh, it's a pin to hold. Mm -hmm. You got stuff on it. Let me hold that car. You vacuum? Yeah. Not really. Hold on. Let's hold this right here. Hold. Gotcha. Yeah. Two handed freak. Oh, I know one? where that goes. That yeah, yeah. <laughs> Goes to the exhaust. Hey, we're running. <laughs> That's the other mission. See what kind of plugs this takes. Remember what we're doing? Oh, my God. I'll put this on the ground here. That's what it looks like when you have the frame off. That's what you need to do go. to get a frame swap. Kind of look around on it. On this thing. It's all good. The roll cage. But I got yeah. a bolt, a broken bolt. So I got to figure that part <clears> out. <throat> See what I got to do. Maybe I'll get a left handed drill bit on it. But they use steel steel bolts, and I think the hardened steel bolts and the aluminum rib together, nut yeah. oxidizes yeah. together. Yeah. So, yeah. set that to the side. Yeah. And now we're on to this piece. I'm going to actually end the video there, do that part one of the frame swap. That's the removal. And then, uh, get, back to you. get back to you. Thanks for watching.